Hey guys, Mike with the Modern Polymath here. We're doing a little IT work today and I got a new toolbox tour for you too. Now it's not this toolbox right here. I told you I got a lot of toolboxes. It's actually a Pelican 1560 that I used as one, well, my main mobile toolbox. So I'm gonna show that to you today. I take this box with me everywhere for all sorts of jobs. So sometimes it doesn't always have the right tools, but for the most part, usually if I'm in the field, I'm doing a little voltage work, and this has most of what I need, except for power tools to get the job done. All right, so let's just start out with an overview of what's in this box. Uh, mostly I have this thing organized with these Klein canvas bags. Uh, I find these are really uh, helpful as far as the size that they are for the tools that I'm keeping. Also, the different colors helps me to quickly identify what I'm going for. What this is, is mostly the consumable sort of specific job I'm going to be doing. RJ45s, cable ties, a basic angle kit, and also this stapler. It's called the Cable Boss. It's made by Gardner Bindner. Um, all it is is a stapler that installs a specific kind of staple that is designed to go over electrical wiring. I have a Klein bolt needle. Nothing particularly special. This one is the MM100, just a down the middle of the road bolt meter. I have some nicer ones and I'll usually grab them when I'm going, but I always have this one all the time just in case. Let's talk drill bits. This is from Milwaukee. I only bought it because it was on sale at the time. They all good drill bits. Again, really anything will work. I got this because I got it on a, a decently good sale and I liked it because it had the long bits. Long bits are what I prefer to use, especially with power tools. And then lastly, this guy. I always call this an installer bit. You've probably seen your local ISP installer come out and drill from the outside of your house to the inside of your house with one of these long drill bits. Starting with these two smaller guys. So the networking one. I have a small network test and trace device. Spare you take the cable tester basically for RJ45. I also have a traditional AC tester, another USB tester, and a circuit tester. This guy right here, cable comb. I love this thing. If you're pulling a lot of lines and you need to keep them organized, you can feed them into this, and then as you pull the line, it will keep them all nice and together. This right here I found online, I don't even know where, cablesupply.com. I'll do a whole video on this uh, if anybody's interested because it's a whole thing within itself. So now let's look at the etc. bag and the cream shrimp punch bag. As I said earlier, this is really mostly about mounting and cutting. Small hammer, a level, a small chain cutter. This right here, which I have two of from DeWalt. But of course, folding, which is nice in a toolbox like this. But then what is also really nice about this guy is it has this file. And what this is helpful for is if you don't get the opening quite right in the drywall, you can use this file to file the drywall and get exactly where you need it. This is the best drywall knife I've ever used. I love this thing. Now let's look at the crimp, shrimp, and punch. I keep the Klein punch down tool little guy with all the accessories. Keep the easy style. RJ45 crimper, got a good old just generic style electrical pliers, and some different strippers. Now let's talk hand tools, stock being with wrenches and sockets. I bent this guy over to fit in there. Got some common wrenches, which I secured together. Small driver, which can also be an extension. Got these nut wrenches. These are really nice to have. There's almost nothing else that does the job. So these are really nice to have. A small driver, quarter inch and three eighths. So it'll fit all the sockets I have in here. And then lastly, this Klein hex set. It covers all the basics so that you always have them in the field. Okay, first out the bag, you have a Klein nut driver. And the other ones, you have a Klein, I think this is like a six in one maybe screwdriver. Klein all, Klein stubby screwdriver. Klein micro screwdriver, another bit, small pry baller, and then some pliers. Got another set of electrician, standard, needle nose, and some flush cuts. And that is why I keep it hand tools.
so thanks for joining me for the latest episode of the Modern Polymath. My name is Mike. If you have any suggestions for what future videos should be, drop a comment and let me know. Go ahead and uh, like, subscribe, all those good things. And thanks for joining me.